quick introduction on Bhagavad Gita. Bhagavad plus Gita. Bhagavad means related to God and Gita means poem. Bhagavad Gita is the song or poem of God himself. When Arjun was completely confused on what to do, what not to do, in the middle of the battlefield, he was confused whether he is having the right goal, whether he is on the right path. At that time, Lord Krishna himself explained Arjun what is his duty. He explained him that what he is doing right now is something which he should do because that is his duty. And therefore, although Bhagavad Gita is a Hindu scripture, but it is a way of life for every human being. I think it is a way of life for everyone to understand their goals, their duty, their work that they need to do in their life. It is believed that Bhagavad Gita was written by Lord Ganesha himself and it was narrated by Vedvyas. It is one of the chapters of Mahabharat manuscript. It is the sixth chapter in Mahabharat. And Bhagavad Gita itself can be read independently as a book. It has got 18 chapters in it. It has got three parts in it. And the chapters have been divided into those parts. The first part is the Karmi Yoga. It runs from chapter 1 to 6. It talks about the means of reaching the final goal of life of a human being. The second part is from chapter 7 to 12 and it is about the Bhakti Yoga. It is about the devotion, the dedication that can help us in reaching to the final goal of our life. The third and the last section of the book is the Gyan Yoga. It runs from chapter 13 to 18. And this is the final goal itself. The Gyan means the knowledge, the knowledge that human beings should strive for, the ultimate knowledge, finding oneself, finding God. And that is why it is considered as an answer to life's questions. Many a times we get confused. What should we do? What should we keep as our goal, as our final destination? What, should, what path we should take? In all such situations, the teachings of Bhagavad Gita can help us find the path for ourselves. So Bhagavad Gita can be the answer to any dilemma, any confusions in our life.